Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are doing good today. So I know I'm in a different type of an outfit right now. This is actually my traditional dress, like traditional attire. We call this Mekhila Sador. So I just decided, like yesterday I was just brainstorming some ideas for my videos and I just decided that, you know what, I want to do like a traditional Indian get ready with me kind of a video using affordable makeup. But I just want to make it Indian, like, you know, traditional type of a thing. And yeah, instead of wearing a sari, I'm wearing my own traditional attire. Also, I just want to say it looks like a sari, but it's not. It is definitely a little bit different. I'll show you guys the whole outfit in like last part of the video. So anyway, let's get started on with this makeup tutorial. It's going to be very, very simple. It's going to contain only affordable makeup. So yeah, without further ado, let's get started. Also, if you are someone who's new to this channel, thank you so much for watching this video. You can hit the subscribe button if you like the content I post four or five days a week. And yeah, let's get on with the video now. So before starting, I do want to say a part of this video is being sponsored by TF Beauty. This is an amazing indie brand on Instagram and I am so happy to be, you know, using their products in this video. So we'll talk more about this brand, their products and everything of that sort later part in the video. But first, I am going to start with my face makeup. So I'm just going to use this uh, lip balm from Plum and I'm just going to hydrate my lips a little bit. So first I'm going to use, this is the plum, uh, this is the green tea oil free moisturizer. Now I'm going to use just two pumps of this one and this I have been using it as my primer and I really like it, it just soaks up into the skin so well. So as you can see, it just gives a very good glow and hydration on the skin. So if you end up, you know, if you buy anything from Plum, you can use my code ERNAKSHI15 to get 15% off. It just earns me a very small, teeny tiny commission. You know, you don't have to use my code if you don't want to. I'm just saying that, you know, I have a code with Plum. So anyway, let's move on with the foundation now. So for foundation, I'm going to use this Miss Claire Everyday Foundation. Now, I have really been enjoying this foundation a lot, a lot, a lot. And I really love it more than my Fit Me foundation, to be very honest. And it just looks so skin-like. It just blends in with the skin so beautifully. It has quite the good amount of coverage as well. Just something that, you know, just to cover up for an everyday. So I'm just going to blend the foundation with my Beauty Blender. So you can totally see how glowy kind of my skin looks right now. So I am going to use this Mars concealer and it's in the shade 03. So after doing my concealer, I'm going to move in with my brows. I'm just going to use a powder to fill them in and that's it. So now coming on to my eyes, I'm actually going to use liquid shadows from Shop TF Beauty. They are on Instagram. They are a very small indie brand on Instagram. And you guys know I am always so supportive of indie brands and I love testing them out always. So Shop TF Beauty, they did send me all of these products like it's been more than a month I've been testing them out and I am ready to talk about these products with you guys. So first, I will talk about the packaging. Obviously, I'll come into the formulation, the shades and everything of that sort. But the packaging is so beautiful, you guys. Like, first of all, like I just want to congratulate her on this amazing packaging because it feels like high-end. I have to tell you, when I first saw these products, I was like, wow, they look so luxe. 
you know so the, uh, i got a uh, you know i got five shades i think so yeah i got five shades of this liquid eyeshadows and they have multi-chrome eyeshadows as well which i'll not be using today but i'll definitely swatch for you guys so i got five liquid eyeshadows now the formulation of this liquid eyeshadows i would say is not like your typical liquid eyeshadows they feel very very different they don't contain a lot of shimmer or glitter in it but it's like a very nice sheen i would say not a lot of liquid shadows in the market has this kind of formulation i'm telling you guys you can totally see in the swatch as well it doesn't have that glitter formula to it it has a very beautiful sheen so what happens is with this liquid shadow is that once you put this on your eyes first of all you don't need that much of liquid shadow once you put this on your eyes you get time to blend this in once you blend it in it sets and it doesn't move away which is so good for summers because a lot of shadows you know uh, not liquid shadows I mean powder shadows or even liquid shadows once you put them in over time it can crease and it just goes away from our eyes but with this one it stays Put. and honestly I love it because you get time to blend your eyeshadows and I really love because you don't have to use them at that much at all so coming on to the shades I'm going to swatch every shade for you guys and you can totally see the color the formulation and everything of that sort but I will use only two shadows on my eyes and create an amazing eye look and you can totally see that by yourself how easy it is to use these shadows even with one shadow you can just blend it in and go out the door and it's going to still look very very good and it's still going to look very glam so first I am going to swatch the shade wildfire you can see how beautiful gorgeous you know orangey type of a red it is it has this amazing orange red undertones to it and I really really love so it so next shadow here is Giza which I actually love it is this amazing bronzy type of a shade that has a little bit of cool undertone to it I mean this type of shadows honestly you don't get to see this kind of shades in other you know liquid shadows and you can see that there is no glitter visible glitters in it it's just like a pure sheen so the next shadow I'm going to swatch for you guys is Sensational. I really love this shade so much. It is so beautiful. It is like this copper orange type of a, you know, shadow that looks so good on the eyes. This is what I have been using, you know, every single day I would do my makeup. I just put this on a little bit and go out the door. It seriously makes my eyes look so good. So today in this video also I'm going to use this. So the next shade we have here is Supreme. Now Supreme I really like because it's not a yellow gold. Now a lot of you know times yellow gold doesn't look good on me. It is this white gold type of a shade which looks so good on the eyes and I can wear this with any eye look with a cool tone eye with a warm tone eye and it's still going to look amazing. So the last shade we have here is the shade Tiramisu. Now I really actually love it because this one is I use it to deepen up my outer corners and again as I said you just need the very tiniest amount and it just blends so well. So Tiramisu is something that I always use to deepen up my outer corners. So now coming on to the multi-chrome eyeshadows. I do have two eyeshadows from the multi-chrome range and these are you know these look very very good in different lighting. Like sometimes this will look pink sometimes it will look green sometimes blue so that's what a multi-chrome shadows are you know so the first shade i'm going to swatch is alex and right i hope i'm pronouncing that right because i mispronounce every every word so this actually is so beautiful because this is like a green but it looks pink you know when you when i when i move my hand in some lights you can see it looks pink and in some lights it's going to look green and even you know sometimes it can give you that blue type of an effect too so this is honestly so good and i'm super excited to try this out in other videos so the next shade we have here is sirasha now this one has a very bronzy but pink type of uh, undertone to it so in some lights it's going to look pink and in some lights it's going to look you know bronzy type of a shade so i really love both the multi-chrome shadows but i'm going to use them in separate videos now i'm going to use the liquid eyeshadow and you can totally see how it looks on the eyes so i'm so i'm going to use two shades right here i'm going to use first the shade sensational actually just using one shadow is like you know it's just going to look good but yeah so first i'm just going to apply this you can see it right here and i'm going to blend it out just with a blending brush i'm just going to blend it out a little so you can totally see that it blends out so nicely like you can see this right here it really blends out very very well so i'm just going to apply this shadow right here as well and blend it in 
So my uh, advice would be to go in with a very, you know, uh, like take your time, go in with little small uh, portions and then blend it out. So you can totally see how glossy my eye look. I mean, I can't zoom you guys in more than this one. But yeah, you can see how glossy my eye is looking. And yeah, only with one shadow, it's looking like this. You can go in with another shadow, but I feel like I really like how this turned out only with the shade Sensational. So I might just keep it this way, maybe add a little bit of a brown liner to, you know, make this pop out a little bit more. But yeah, I really like how it's looking. So I just completed my this eye and I have to tell you guys, my eyes are looking very editorial-ish. I really love how, how beautiful and blended this looks only with one shadow. Now I'm going to go in with a brown liner. So I'm going to go in with this Rimmel brown liner and I'm just going to draw like a wing type of a thing. Now I'm going to go in with my Maybelline Falsies Mascara. So now moving on to my bronzer situation, I'm going to use two bronzers actually today. So because I want a little bit of that golden type of a look, I'm going to use the Miss Rose bronzer and I'm going to use the Color Essence bronzer mixed in together. As for blush, I'm going to use this Just Her blush in Soft Nude. And the same brush I used to blend my eyeshadow, I'm just going to, you know, put this on my lower lashes and whatever is left on this brush, I'm just going to blend it on my lower lashes. Now for my lips, I'm going to go in with this Wet n Wild Lip Liner in the shade Chestnut. And as for lipstick, I'm going to use this Wet n Wild Lipstick again. It's in the shade Never Nude. And I really love this because it's, uh, as you can see, it is very light. And the last thing I'm going to use is this falsies. Now what I'm going to do is, you guys know, I always cut half of this falsies and I apply the half on my outer corners like this. It's very, very simple. So this is how the look turned out. It is very, very easy type of a glam. I didn't do much on the eyes. You guys saw, I just used one shadow and that's it. And yeah, definitely do check out Shop TF Beauty on Instagram. They have amazing products, you guys. And I'm sure you guys are going to love them. And yeah, I will show you guys my outfit right now. I'm just sweating so much. So yeah, let's move on to the whole outfit.